Hi there, this is Tabby and Flair. Hi. And guess what? We're now official Doodle World content Yay! creators. <laughs> you fell over. Ow. We've been having a look at the new Battle Pass and it's got some really cool items on it, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, I love the skins. Yeah, me too. Now, there's a premium and a free-to-play option and quite a few people on the service have been saying, it's not fair, I don't have Robux and I want the Galaxy Tint Brush. Well, you can get the premium Battle Pass for free. It's actually not that hard. We've been running some numbers and having a look how long it would take for free to play or premium players who don't want to spend or don't have the robux or the gems for the 6000 for the premium part. It's actually pretty easy to get this for free. Assuming that you're a completely free to play player, you will be getting 200 robux after playing for an hour and a half every day. It will probably take you almost that to do the daily missions. And if you want this, you're going to be wanting to do the daily missions to unlock all the tiers. So you'll be getting that, but you can also get 150 extra gems every day by trading 30 VP. And that's the same whether you're free to play or premium. It's 150 gems for 30 VP every day. You might think it's hard to get VP, but it's actually really easy. I mean, some of the tasks you have to do for this are doing PVP battles. So you'll be getting VP for doing some battles. You can battle with friends, you can battle in ranked. And you can do wonder trades to get VP. You can also get VP tickets in Runic Island or VP tokens. I can't remember what they're called. But that's another way you can pick up VP. It's really easy to get at least 30 for this. I'm just going to do some wonder trades now. Mm -hmm. So as long as you wonder trade something with a tint or misprint, if you were the original trainer who caught it, you get 5 VP for each one. Oh, that's good. Yeah, it's really good. So I do this most days because if I do Runic Island runs, I nearly always get at least one of these that I don't really want. So I'll catch it and put it into the wonder trade. I'll see what I get. I don't think I'll get anything good, but it doesn't matter. I'll be getting the VP. Oh, I did. Ooh. Someone else put a tint in there. It's a jolly tin. That's really cool. Thank you. So, yeah, basically it's 350 gems for free to play players. As long as you do all those things, if you're premium, you'll be getting 525 per day with the boost for being premium. I averaged that out assuming that you play for 90 minutes a day that's assuming that you follow all the steps i mentioned each day and also you'll be picking up a few gems from the basic battle pass anyway which go towards it we worked out that premium players should hit the 6,000 gems by day 13 of doing this and free to play players should reach it by day 16 and for completing the premium pass you do get rewarded with 6,000 gems so it basically pays for itself now, not everybody, I'm looking at you, Flair, Maybe. wants to do that hard work. And some people, and that's fine, have decided to spend Robux and get their stuff early. Maybe. So, Flair, what did you do with your Galaxy Tint Brushes? I'm going to use one on my wall freeze. Okay, that sounds cool. <gasps> that looks so good. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, so it also gets the Galaxy Aura. I love the Galaxy Tint Brush. Yeah, are you glad you used it on that one? Yeah. It looks good. And what about your second one? I need to use that on my hat tricks. Definitely. Okay. Gonna use it. Okay. What will it look like? Let's see. Oh, <gasps> that looks so good. I love oh, it. Oh, I love that. And I'm still jealous of your Valentine skin. Mm -hmm. It's so pretty. So basically, that is what the tint brush looks like. And that's how to get the premium battle pass for free if you don't want to spend Robux. You can also spend Robux like Flair did. Yeah. And you get the stuff quicker. But if you want to have a bit of a grind and have fun doing the missions, because I find them pretty fun, then it's a really easy way. You know that you're going to be able to hit those targets within a couple of weeks. Yep. And you have until the 2nd of March, which at the time of recording is 43 days, to complete the battle pass. So we're going to keep working on that, aren't we? Yeah. And we'll see you soon. Thanks so much for everyone who supported us on our way to getting content creator status. All right. Bye.